Hello guys, what's up? So today's video is three lovely new additions. Sweet. So let's get started and see what I decided to get. So here is a Seergo Pacus Shoidy. This is the third one after the Ray the First and Ray the Second died. So this one here is a half an inch uh, and sex specimen, so this one I'm going to call Adrian. So uh, that's a Syrigopacus shoidi, the Malaysian earth tiger. Now, uh, this one here is a very unique one, and you guys are in a special treat for this one. But, you know, since I was bummed out that uh, Christine died, that was my Hapapama von Worthy, I decided to replace her with this beauty. Let's go transfer her. So here's the terrarium I'm going to use. It's a normal size critter keeper with at least 80 to 90 percent of the whole terrarium covered with uh, eco earth, a little cork bark, and a little water dish. You always have to have this. Okay, so mystery tea. Guys don't know what it is. It's the haplopelma that I was talking about. Okay, this one here is haplopelma minax, thylon black. I actually got the right one. So this one here is a three inch uh, female. So minus here we go. Alrighty. Get the paintbrush and let's give an idea of what temperament she is. She's like a Hapal Palma. She should be aggressive. Here we go. Oh, I gotta do a lot of prodding. It doesn't seem lively, but then again, she was in transit. I just went to her place just a couple of hours ago, but I think she's fine. There we go, nice. Here we go. Hapopelma Minax. Thylon Black. <laughs> awesome. Now for this species. Very unique. And this is one is not actually a tarantula. It's a megalomorph. A diplorid to be precise. So this one here, you're in for a special treat. So behold, Lenotheli megalothoides. So this is a one and a half inch unsexed specimen. And what's unique about it, it's really cool. It's an avid web builder from Brazil. So it's uh, a new world species. It's not a tarantula as it doesn't have urticating hair and uh, it doesn't have the feet that tarantulas do have, but they have very similar working uh, chlorocyri and their jaws that they open upward and downward motion, but what really is, gives a great characteristic of this species is the oversized spinnerets that they have. So maybe if I brought it to the other side, you'll be able to see it. I mean, this is like a monstrous size. So I thought, you know, it's pretty unique since I don't have any of these. This is the first one. And consequently, there's not much information about this on YouTube. So um, I don't know pretty much about it. So I'm going to do a lot of research and fill you guys in what I know about the species. As far as venom is concerned for this one, it's more or less like your uh, G. Rosea. Apparently, they're not very aggressive spiders, but certainly they are very quick. 
and these spiders do actually need to be more fed more often than the regular teas. This one here I would have to feed it once a week but uh, judging by its growth rate, uh, it grows pretty quickly. They go having a 4 inch leg span as they get adults. So that's a uh, pretty sight to see. So guys, so this is the video of uh, the new additions with uh, Lenotheli Megathelodes. I'm not sure what the common name of this uh, spider is. Haplopelma minax, Thailand black. And here is uh, Siugopagus shoidi, the Malaysian earth tiger. Awesome.